Meanwhile, Ray Dalio, if I'm saying it right, D-A-L-I-O, maybe it's Dalio. He runs a $165 billion hedge fund called Bridgewater Associates. And he sent out a note today to his uh, investors. Financial Times picked up that said, oh, this is interesting. His, what his note said, his, his note pointed out that in 1933, you had the Great Crash in 1929. In 1933, Roosevelt became president. The Fed started loosening the monetary, um, whatever you call it, policy, I guess, and printing money, as it were, a loose money policy, sort of like we did with quantitative easing. They stopped that in 1937, and it was too soon. They really needed to do it another four or five years, but they stopped at 1937, and the result was a two-year recession because the Fed raised interest rates too early. And Ray DeLeo is saying, you know, that 1937 scenario, which happened eight years after the Great Crash, well, we're now eight years after this last Great Crash, and please don't do the same thing you did eight years after the last Great Crash.